How do you describe technical or overly complicated concepts to an audience that's not familiar with your expertise? Well, you could read a definition. You could go to Wikipedia, the dictionary, or some scientific journal and read them that definition. That often confuses audiences. And remember, today's audiences are highly distractible. A much better way to describe your concept is a metaphor or a comparison to something that's concrete in their minds already. Here's a quick example. Now, this example makes the assumption that people know what the imposter syndrome is. There is another concept called the Dunning-Kruger effect. If you're not familiar with that, here's the technical definition. It's a cognitive bias in which people with limited competence in a particular domain overestimate their abilities. People can probably figure that out, but not necessarily. There's a lot of technical aspect to it. And there are curves and graphs. And Here's a simpler way to explain it. Say for most people, the Dunning-Kruger effect is the opposite of imposter syndrome. Instantly, people who know what imposter syndrome is are going to know, oh, it's just the opposite. It must be people who think a little too much of themselves or overestimate their abilities. That's a better way that more quickly gets your point across to the audience. Because one of the biggest challenges I see with most speakers is they get lost in the weeds. They get caught up in the details and audiences get bored with that. We need to make our points faster, concrete, and then move on to the next point in our presentations. If you want to get your points across, think of a metaphor or a well-known concept that you can compare your topic to so that people don't get lost in the details and get bored with your presentation. Try it.